Hi there and welcome to our next video on energy transfers. This is a continuation from our last video, but in this video we're going to be looking at some exam questions. So let's get started. Our first exam question states, A car has an energy in its kinetic store as it is moving at 20 miles per second. The driver applies the brakes and brings the car to a stop. Describe the energy transfers that take place and it's worth two marks. So the car is moving, so this means it has kinetic energy. So if it has kinetic energy, it is moving and then the driver puts the car to a stop and this means there's friction between the road and the tyres of the car and because it's a sudden brake, that means the friction increases which means there's more heat and this means whenever we're talking about heat, it must mean there's a thermal energy store. So the kinetic energy is transferred to the thermal energy store thermal energy and in our next video we're going to be looking at mechanical working so this is done by mechanical working and you need to write that to get the mark and that will give you two marks next question the diagram below shows a cyclist riding along a flat road. Complete the sentence. Choose answers from the box. So, chemical is anything stored in an object. So, it might be stored in the cyclist's body. Elastic potential is anything that's being stretched. Gravitational potential energy is anything which is not on the floor. And kinetic energy is stored in a moving object. So, as a cyclist accelerates, the something energy store in the cyclist's body in decreases. So this means that it can't be kinetic energy because the cyclist is riding along. So that means the kinetic energy is going to increase. Gravitational potential uh, energy, the cyclist is on the ground. So that means it has zero gravitational potential energy. So it can't be that. And elastic potential energy is something being stretched. Nothing is being stretched over here. So we know it's going to be chemical potential energy. This is the chemical energy stored in the cyclist's body. And something energy increases. So we know that this is going to be kinetic energy because the cyclist is moving. And that will give you two marks. Next question. The diagram shows a climber partway up a cliff. Complete the sentence. When the climber moves up the cliff, the climber gains gravitational something energy. So gravitational Potential energy is the answer because we can't see it. It is stored in the person because it, he is not on the ground. We can't see the gravitational potential energy and that will give you one mark. Next question. To lift the person or to the helicopter, the electric motor transformed 21,600 joules of energy usefully. Use a form of energy from the box to complete the following sentence. The electric motor transfers electrical energy to kinetic energy. The kinetic energy is then transferred into a useful something energy. So over here, the helicopter is lifting the person up. So the person is going off the ground. So he is no longer going to be on the ground. So this means it's going to be transformed into gravitational potential energy because he is not on the ground. And that is useful as well. And that will give you one mark. Next question. Complete the sentences. Choose the answers from the box. As the drone accelerates upwards, it's... So whenever the drone is accelerating upwards, it's getting off the ground. So one of the answers is going to be gravitational potential energy. Gravitational potential energy energy uh, increases and something else increases this word accelerates gives us the clue it means that it's going at a really quick speed so we know it's going to be kinetic and the something energy store of the battery decreases so we know because it's associated with battery we know it's going to be nuclear energy because it's associated with batteries it can't be chemical because chemical 
potential energy it is stored um, in the object and it's something which ha in it involves chemicals elastic potential is something that's being stretched so it must be nuclear and that will give you three marks next question our final question before the student jumps off the bridge he has a store of so if the student is on the bridge it must mean he's not on the floor so this means he must have gravitational potential energy gravitational potential potential energy and then when he's falling the student source of what energy increases where so he's falling at a speed so we know that this is going to be kinetic energy kinetic energy and then when the bungee cord is stretched the cord stores energy as so this word stretched means that it's something associated with elastic potential energy elastic potential energy and that will give you three marks and that is it for this video thanks for watching i hope you liked it and one last thing please subscribe hit the like button and the notification bell